Hey, I'm Jim Weber in the Fox 13 Weather Center. Thanks for logging on to MyFoxHurricane.com. So here we are into the month of October, uh, and here's the names that we've used so far this season. Lorenzo, still active, working its way, uh, now heading towards the North Atlantic, heading towards the Azores. Now, throughout the month of October, we start to focus a bit closer to home. We're not looking way out towards Africa for those systems at this point. Not to say that they can't happen, but that's not typically where you're going to start to see them this time of the year. So we look across the western Atlantic, the Gulf of Mexico, and down into the Caribbean. Those are the favored locations for development. Now, that big wide view. Got a couple of areas that we're watching. One to the north of Puerto Rico, another one in the central uh, Caribbean. Neither one of these systems really showing anything over the next, say, five days. But down in the Caribbean, into the Gulf of Mexico, we're going to watch that pretty closely as we head through the weekend and into next week. Here is Hurricane Lorenzo. Uh, now, yesterday, some dry air, so a little bit of wind shear was affecting this, so the eye was getting a bit clouded over. Now you can start to see that eye pretty well on the enhanced satellite imagery. Winds right now are at 100 miles an hour, 35.2, 37.9, still that same basic forecast track, basically heading towards the Azores later on this evening uh, with winds potentially up to about 100 miles an hour, maybe slightly weaker as it continues to work its way to the north and then it loses those tropical characteristics as we head through the second half of the week and this could bring a pretty gusty storm to parts of Scotland as we get into the weekend so that we'll be watching that as well but it would not be a tropical system at that point now I mentioned we watch across the Caribbean and into the Gulf of Mexico GFS European really starting to hit more and more at just a, a broad area of low pressure across the Caribbean working its way up into the Gulf of Mexico and that's going to bring a lot of moisture that will help to increase our rain chances over the state and there could be something trying to develop now this is still a long ways off still way too early to tell but it's that time of the year where we do have to watch these areas so we're going to watch it and we're going to keep you updated right here on myfoxhurricane.com